That's substantially above the national jobless rate. Scott Horsley, NPR News, traveling with the president. People on both sides of the Arab-Israeli struggle in San Diego say they have conflicting feelings over yesterday's prisoner swap. A 25-year-old Israeli sergeant held for the past five years by Hamas was freed, and Israel released more than 1,000 Palestinian prisoners. Israeli Elaud Marad is in San Diego working with the pro-Israel organization Stand With Us. He shares the mixed reaction many Israelis have. I have to say that it's really a painful price because we had to release more than uh, 1,000 terrorists that killed more than 150 uh, Israelis. Farid Abdul Noor, director of San Diego State Center for Islamic and Arabic Studies, says the thousand to one exchange reflects the difference in power between Israel and Palestine. Of course, it was unfair to capture him, just as it is unfair for Israel to enter into the West Bank and Gaza and capture people in the hundreds on a weekly basis. Professor Abdul Noor pointed out that at least the prisoner swap means both sides are acknowledging one another, which is a necessary step on the path toward peaceful resolution.